as you can see, the parade has started. So who's, who's carrying those banners, uh, Jeff, you know? Some sweet people, some dear people. Dan and Anthony, and Erica and Tracy. And Erica and Tracy, give it up for Dan and Anthony and Erica and Tracy. One step starts a movement. The 27th Annual Lesbian and Gay Bisexual Transgender Pride Parade and Festival. Wow. And then, uh, oh my gosh, it's not Erica, it's Paulette. And it's Paulette. Where's Erica? Erica, Paulette, where's hey, Paulette? And what we have coming up next is the Imperial Dove Court's Color Guard. Wonderful. guest is going to sing the uh, national anthem today. His name is Daniel Townsend. He's a class of 2017 grad from Fresno State. Uh, music performance. And uh, I just uh, want to thank you, Dan, for, for, for sharing your talents. Please remove your caps and we're going to do the national anthem. Thank you. So proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming, whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight, or the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming. And the rocket's red glare, the bombs bursting in air, gave proof through the night that our flag was still there. Oh, say does that star-spangled banner yet wave? Thank you to our color guard tonight. Today. Thank you, IDC. The gentleman that's photographing here, that's Ray, and he is the vice president of the group. And he's like, don't, don't point me out, don't point me out. Don't be shy, Ray. So there's a, a bowling season. There's, there's bowling season, they have three a year. Okay. They just go around the clock. Like duck hunting or duck, duck season? Well, this duck season lasts all year round. Wonderful. Bowling is a lifetime commitment. 
So you'll notice that we have some photographers running around. Franco here is one of our official photographers, as well as Andrew Losh, wherever he is at. Andrew's right here. We just love the Andrew Losh. Oh, there Andrew is. He's blending in with the black speakers. So Ray is constantly posting fabulous photos from stuff at Alibi and Legends, and also for all the stuff that the bowlers do. So if you want to go do something fun, and you're looking for a great group, you've got to be a part of the Rainbow Bowlers, the Fresno Rainbow Bowling League. They celebrate everybody's birthday. Every Wednesday and Thursday, there's a birthday party going on there at the lane. They also raised almost $1,000 for Pride this year at a bowlathon, so I want to give it up for Fresno Rainbow League. Number seven, Fresno Gay, Lesbian, Bi, Trans, Youth Alliance. That's been going on for two decades, maybe more. This February will mark a 30-year anniversary of gay youth in Fresno. Friday night. Yeah. You know, we're looking about having a 30-year anniversary party in February. So any of you, and many of you standing here, probably have gone one time or another to the Fresno Youth Alliance. I want to tell you that we have some folks here the very first gay kids when we got together in 1988, they are now 45 to 50. Those kids that were teenagers in 1988 are 45 to 50 now. And this is the newest incarnation of the youth group. The, the big flag that they're carrying, folks, they're carrying them like they do in the bigger parades and they're really looking for people to donate money or change your dollars, and they're going to use that for their activities. So if you remember what it was like being a gay kid and not having anywhere to go or anything to do, throw some coin in their big flag. Very, very colorful, very diverse, very inclusive. Yeah. So our group has gay, lesbian, bisexual, trans, queer, questioning, and allied youth. Wonderful. Every Friday night at 7 o'clock to 8.30 at the Big Red Church. You got blue hair and purple hair. Very nice, very nice. Good job. And I want to tell you, they've been working on waving those flags for the last couple weeks. Woo oh my goodness. And that is...